This week I had a fantastic opportunity to visit another school in my area, well not exactly my area, it took me about an hour and a half to reach the area where that um, school visit was taking place, but I had a fantastic opportunity to visit a really future focused innovative school in New Zealand and I was really really blown away by how different it was but also how learner focused it was and that's something that was really exciting for me to see. So Hobson Four Point Secondary School is a fairly new school that takes a very innovative approach to learning in New Zealand. The campus is set up almost as a tertiary institution which was really cool to see. Open space learning areas, there's not a BYOD program that has been implemented, it's just happened over time by itself. When we went in, there were students practicing dance out in the hallways. I suppose you could call them hallways, but they were just so open. It felt like there were no hallways anywhere. It was all just very open. There were science labs with no walls, students participating in those. There were some children wearing uniform tops and when I asked about their uniform policy, I was told that yes, the school does has a uniform policy, but no, it's not enforced, which is a far cry from what I've seen at all of the other schools I've visited. It's just such an interesting concept. The school does do NCEA, which is just like my school, except they don't focus on level 1 at all. Their uh, equivalent of Year 11 studies is focused on getting the students to gain 20 quality credits at level 1. So this means that when they go up to level 2, they only need to gain 60 level 2 credits but the ones that they already have at level 1 are good quality credits so that they can boost their achievement overall. They run a lot of project based initiatives throughout the community which is a very close community from the impression I got and the school itself is, is very small at least compared to my own school in South Auckland. The absolute highlight of my entire visit was being given the opportunity to meet Gerard McManus who is the president of the Digital Technologies Teachers Aotearoa Initiative. He's the, he's the owner of our subject area association in the country pretty much and he used to teach at my school which was really exciting because I was able to share with him different things and he knew where I was coming from personally like the environment that I am used to and we were able to have a good conversation about the differences in the area just because he's already had that experience in the past. He talked about how a lot of his programs were project based and that's something that I would really really like to bring into my own practice so that's something that I have definitely taken note of especially his ideas around integrating digital technology with other subjects were absolutely massive. I am so excited to bring this to my own school and really excited to start exploring the opportunities that digital technologies allows us in different subject areas. So those kind of were my key takeaways from the visit. Number one, the huge point of difference but still being able to see student success in both their school and my own school. Number two, the huge community integration, which is something that my school does do, but myself in my own practice, it's something that I would like to incorporate. And number three is incorporating those cross-curricular subjects, digital technologies focused projects and initiatives throughout the entire school, which is something I want to focus my leadership project on next year.